The most important natural resource for any animal living in the wild is food. They must eat to stay alive, so they will attain this goal by any means necessary, even if it means fighting other animals. If you want to see how it all goes down on the toughest battlefield, keep watching, because we're getting started. Number 15, Wild Dogs and Hyenas Fighting. A pack of wild dogs caught a male impala antelope. While they were feeding, a hyena picked up and tried to steal their kill from them. The hyena soon realized it had bitten off more than it could chew. The wild dogs gave the scavenger a good run for his money and showed the scavenger it wasn't the biggest gun in the West. Hyenas are everyone's worst enemy and wild dogs are no exception. When wild dogs and hyenas meet, anything can happen. The hyenas enjoy a good laugh and the wild dogs observe and plan. In this video, a brawl breaks out when hyenas kill and eat an impala that wild dogs were chasing. The hyenas tell the dogs it's first come first serve, but the dogs don't care, and they want the impala back. If these two wild dogs think they're going to make these hyenas nervous, they have something else coming. The dogs will need the entire pack and then some to scare, even two hyenas away. More hyenas arrive, but the dogs continue to taunt the scavengers, which is usually what wild dogs enjoy doing, even if it means risking injuries and possibly even dying. Onlookers came across wild dogs at a dam and realized there was a dead impala in the water. The wild dogs then left the dam for over an hour before returning. Once they returned, a few hyenas also came and began to fight over the impala carcass, with the hyenas winning in the end. Two hyenas must face the wrath of an entire pack of wild dogs, but it's nothing they can't handle. The hyenas work together and keep the dogs at bay as they run around in circles, hoping the dogs eventually give up and leave. But wild dogs are as tenacious as hyenas, especially when the hyenas are thieves stealing their food. Number 14, Leopard and Hyena Fight Over Food After making a kill, a leopard was robbed by a spotted hyena, which isn't unusual, except the leopard wasn't taking it and decided to challenge a scavenger to get his kill back, but things didn't turn out for the best because the stubborn hyena stood its ground and didn't let the leopard anywhere close to the carcass as it charged into the feline like a bull. In this video, we could see one young male leopard up a tree stripping clean what is left of an animal carcass and another below looking for scraps and finally a hyena running off with a small piece of the carcass. There are no laws in the bush, so animals attack and steal whatever they can. This cunning female leopard impressed onlookers by taking down a large male impala, but as quickly as she brought it down, a hyena that had been listening to the action took ownership of the impala even before either of them had killed it. But the leopard was not ready to give up her hard-earned prize and aggressively tried to reclaim it. The leopard in this video made a kill but was robbed by a spotted hyena, which happens often in the bush. The big cat came back at the hyena and tried her best, which worked to a point as the sneaky cameo at the end shows. In this video, a male leopard is trying to reclaim his meal from a stubborn hyena. Both animals are pulling on the carcass and the big cat ends up with most of it, even though the scavenger can be seen with a piece of the carcass in its mouth. The leopard slowly walks away from the hyena with the carcass in its mouth and the hyena doesn't chase it. I guess the story has a happy ending for the leopard after all. Number 13, Vultures and Jackals Fight. The cheetahs were just finishing a reed buck kill as the vultures moved in to grab the scraps. That's when a jackal circled the group and began charging into the committee of vultures, eventually driving them back so the small scavenger could get its fill. Blackback jackals are opportunists that can be entertaining to watch as they lurk around kills looking for scraps. While vultures are not everyone's favorite, they can also be fun to watch and serve a purpose. Jackals and vultures sparring for a meal can be a lot of fun to watch. In this video, a jackal fights some vultures for the scraps of a lion kill in Kruger National Park. It's normal that jackals and vultures fight because they are often confronted to each other, battling to get the remaining scraps of a carcass. This next battle is intense and wild. A jackal can be seen attacking a vulture and it's all over the vulture, so much so that you would think the scavenger bird is toast, but it's not the case. 
The vulture can be seen trying to run away before the jackal knocks it down again. But the vulture is still not done. After resting for a few seconds, he tries running in the opposite direction to escape, but it's not easy. This looks more like a dance performance than a fight. Number 12. Badger and Fox Fight Over Food This badger takes some dog food when a fox tries to take it. The badger attacks the fox and nearly rips it to shreds, but the fox manages to run, presumably with a few scrapes and bruises. The American badger is a fossorial carnivore, which means it forages for food underground by digging or scouting for dens. Even though foxes are not their primary food source, they have been known to take a fox cub on rare occasions. Foxes will not fight a badger if given the option. A fox will be unable to defeat it because they are far too fierce and tough and almost forgot to mention, nuts. In this video, however, the fox needs to protect his food, so he takes a shot at the badger and it pays off because he manages to chase the badger away during a rare occasion. Generally speaking, badgers and foxes can coexist without too much trouble. Let's say they can tolerate each other, even though sometimes things can get out of hands. But when it comes to the crunch, the badger is the boss. So. It is quite unusual to see the female vixen fox in this video so upset and losing food to the badger. She is clearly not happy about it, but what can she do? This incident began by accident when the people filming were feeding some birds and discovered by fluke a badger feeding on some garbage on the ground. This led them to wonder what else might be around, so they brought a camera and were simply amazed by what they saw. They put scraps of food out and peanuts and sat back to watch, and this is the show they got to witness. As I mentioned in the previous video, badgers and foxes usually get along, and you could see a perfect example of this here when both the badgers and the foxes are seen foraging and minding their own business. Number 11. Wild Dogs Fight Lions Over Food Even though wild dogs are some of the most successful hunters in the bush, they are no match for lions, especially one-on-one. -on -one. In this video, two wild dogs were chasing an impala and were so focused on the chase that they didn't realize they were running right through a lion's pride's encampment. Lo and behold, one of the male lions intercepted one of the dogs and made chopped liver out of it in seconds. The other dog got away, but so did its lunch. A lioness stands her ground against an angry pack of wild dogs protecting their den. She didn't run away or leave her cub, but stood there and protected herself and the little guy. It turns out that this lioness has been on her own for eight years and has raised other single male cubs like this before in this area. Other guides in the park have seen her go through bigger battles than this against other lions and hyenas. She has a reputation for being incredibly strong and fearless against any threat. That's probably why the wild dogs didn't attack again. When a pack of wild dogs sees a massive male lion approaching their kill, they don't waste any time and scamper off. They're better off going and try to make another kill than fighting this lion. The lion, like the king that he is, just walks over to the carcass and enjoys it. It's good to be the king. Number 10. Wild Dogs Eating Impala Impala is a food of choice in the bush, and wild dogs have a special liking for it, firstly because they're small and easy to kill once they are caught, and secondly, because they taste good. In our thumbnail, you could see what wild dogs do when they encounter an impala. Those are not hugs and kisses, just in case you're wondering. When wildlife enthusiasts book a trip to Africa to experience life in the bush, they hope they get to see a few exciting hunts and sightings of wild animals. But for the onlookers filming this video, they didn't even have to leave their lodge because the wild dogs took the hunt to them as you could see the animals attacking and ripping an impala apart right in the yard of the lodge. The impala is on the menu for many African predators. It's extremely fast and not easy to capture, but once a predator lays its paws on an impala, it's almost a sure kill. The hard part is catching it. After capturing an impala that tripped as it jumped over the bushes, these wild dogs rip the insides of the animal while it is still alive. They don't waste any time killing it, they just eat right through it. Everyone likes fresh food, and this is as fresh as it gets. This impala was caught by two wild dogs on the side of a dirt road, and it didn't take the canines long to disembowel the animal. When a third wild dog saw all the fun his friends were having, he didn't hesitate to join the group. Another food orgy is taking place in this video as a pack of wild dogs swarms an impala and butchers it like the master butchers that they are. The impala tries to get away, but when you have 10 famished beasts that want to eat you, 
on your back, the only place to go is nowhere. Number nine, eagle and coyote fighting. The people filming this video spotted a coyote in the distance and tried to shoot him at long range with a small caliber in some heavy wind. Suddenly, an eagle swooped down out of nowhere and tried to help, but the coyote held his ground with the bird of prey and won the day. Golden eagles square off against coyotes in a battle for scavenging dominance. There is a large carcass on the ground and all the animals want a piece of it. After the eagles take a few bites, the coyotes walk in and get their share. Yellowstone is one of the snowiest areas in America and it quickly transforms into a winter wonderland as the season develops. But it's a perfectly balanced fight for survival for Yellowstone's wildlife as bald eagles and a coyote fight over a cadaver. A coyote and an eagle fight over a fresh deer carcass. The eagle stands over the carcass and begins to get a taste of the dead animal when a coyote comes to annoy it for a taste of the kill. But the eagle charges the coyote several times, trying to discourage it. However, the coyote is tenacious and tries over and over to get the carcass until the coyote takes control of the situation and decides to charge the eagle, sending the bird of prey home for good. Number eight, crocodile fights with lion for food. When lions and crocodiles find themselves going head to head for possession of an animal carcass, both animals must outwit each other to end up with the prize. Since both animals are powerful apex predators, it usually ends in a stalemate and all the animals get to eat, but it's not always the case. These lions and this crocodile were invited at the same function to raise funds for endangered species, but when they got to the dinner table to enjoy some ribs, the two animals didn't see eye to eye. They both knew they were there for a good cause, but I guess when you hate one another, it doesn't matter what the cause is. This male lion is involved in a tug of war with the crocodile and neither of the two animals is giving up. The crocodile keeps his grip on the dead animal's leg while the lion pulls on the other side of the carcass. The lion slowly begins to pull the carcass towards him as the reptile still hangs on. It's so funny how they don't attack each other so they get the entire carcass for themselves. They respect each other's strength so much, so they prefer playing tug of war. Number seven, lion and hyena fight over food. It seems like the lions did not invite these hyenas to their dinner, but the scavengers turned up anyhow and boy did they crash the party. Even though the lions growled and snarled and tried to intimidate the hyenas, the scavengers laughed and giggled the entire time. The lions didn't find it funny and stood their ground and were not about to let a bunch of giggling hyenas ruin their dinner. In this video, a cackle of hyenas, 12 strong, assembles to annoy a pride of lions on a kill. The lions have killed a buffalo, and the hyenas want a piece of it, if not all of it. These hyenas are so sly and strategic, it always boggles my mind to watch them figure things out. After the lions finish their meal, the hyenas can be seen fighting over what's left. It's a rare occurrence to see a lion and a bunch of hyenas together, but in this video, they were brought together by food. They fed together for a while until the male lion got tired of the hyenas giggling and crackling bad jokes, so he chased them away. Once he filled his tummy, he left the scraps for them. A few moments later, another hyena clan showed up and there was a lot of bullying going on, but nothing serious between the two clans. Number six, jackals attack Impala. In Kenya's Maasai Mara, two jackals kill an Impala. It took them three tries and more than 10 minutes, but they succeeded and the family later joined the party. It's never easy for jackals to make a kill. They usually come in after the fact and take whatever scraps are left. This jackal has already injured a springbok and along with a few friends, it keeps tormenting the animal. The springbok is much bigger than the jackal, but the jackal has the advantage as it bites at the springbok's legs to weaken it until the animal will eventually crumble to the ground. Some jackals may gather to scavenge a carcass or to hunt larger prey such as antelope, gazelles, and livestock, but normally hunt alone or in pairs. They have been known to take larger prey such as adult impala as you can see in this video as they hunt the animal in the water and drown it before they drag it out as fast as they can to eat it. Number five, two raccoons fighting. In the event of an intruder, especially a dominant male raccoon, a raccoon colony will resort to fighting amongst itself. Depending on the severity of the attack, one or both animals may suffer life-threatening injuries. When defending their territory, raccoons are known to battle until the intruder flees. In this video, 
one of the raccoons left before the fighting ever began. There is a lot of snarling and some fighting in this video, but both raccoons eventually settle down and decide it's better to eat than fight. Someone driving on a road at night spotted these two raccoon wrestlers going at it, so they stopped their car and decided to film the event. The bigger raccoon overpowered the smaller one, which tried to defend itself to the best of its abilities. Number 4. Vultures Eat Wild Boar I'm not sure if this vulture killed this young boar, but he's lucky enough to have him all to himself. Oh, wait. Another vulture arrives and asks his friend if he could join him. It doesn't look like it's a problem, because there's plenty to go around for both birds. I'm surprised the boar was in such good condition at the point when the vultures arrived, unless they killed it. This video clearly demonstrates how efficient vultures are when they descend upon a wild boar carcass and devour it in 30 seconds. Now that's what I call cleaning up the house. As the people filming this video were driving along a road in Florida, they decided to stop to watch some vultures feeding on a wild boar carcass. The boar was huge and didn't have important injuries on its body. Perhaps the animal died of natural causes. Number 3. Ravens and Eagles Fight for Food When an eagle swoops down to snatch a rabbit it's chasing, a raven calls out the eagle to let him know he wants some. But the eagle couldn't care less about the raven and tells him to find his own food. These ravens can't do anything to stop a bald eagle that wants their food. The eagle is huge compared to the ravens, and even though they outnumber him, there's no point for the ravens to attack such a powerful and dangerous bird. Number 2. Wolves and Bears Fight for Food When these white wolves try to harass a bear for food, the bear stands his ground and fends the wolves off until they become discouraged and walk away, while the bear continues to eat, paying no attention to the intruders. The wolf pack in this video had originally taken down an elk. When they came back to the carcass, they were surprised to find a grizzly bear had stolen it, so they challenged the bear for the carcass, but the bear was having none of it as he screamed at the wolves, finders keepers, eventually the wolves moved on, leaving the bear alone with their kill. And number 1. Lion Fights Lion This lion challenges the pride's prime male climbing over a tiny wall and attacking him right away. For whatever reason, the females try to intercede. The males quickly turn their focus to the females, leading them to take a step back. As the girls try to intercede again, the fight moves into the bushes, but the violent struggle continues. The fight appears to have ended suddenly, but it hasn't. The two lions reappear, and it appears there is no obvious winner as the lions leave the battlefield but return for another struggle despite their exhaustion. The females give the lions a piece of their mind while also safeguarding their young. It's amusing, but I think male lions act exactly like men, or it's probably the other way around. Lions fighting is not uncommon. Male lions frequently fight for territory and females, often to the death. If the invading males are successful in killing or subduing the pride's alpha males, the first thing they do is slaughter all the pride's cubs. They do this for two reasons. First. They want to destroy the loser's offspring's gene pool, and second, the lionesses will enter estrus much sooner without cubs to wean. Several lionesses will attack a single unknown male for the same reason. They are afraid he will kill their cubs. A group of male lions will have no qualms about killing a single lioness if they perceive her to be a threat to their food supply, especially if she is not in estrus. The complexities of a life in a lion pride are complicated and often brutal. Young males are chased out of their pride as soon as they reach sexual maturity, which occurs around the age of two. These befuddled teenagers venture into the unknown, frequently becoming prey to alpha males in other territories, becoming entangled in snares if they venture near human settlements, or being fatally injured while hunting for prey. You must believe me when I tell you that life in the bush is hard, even for lions. It's clear that living in the bush is not easy, even for apex predators. Every day, it's a battle to survive. Which one is your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be a part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.